Okay, I'm back again with a quick unboxing for you guys. This time of my new Xantrex X Power Power Source 400. And what this is is a pretty powerful UPS system. Doesn't have the highest VA rating, it's 650 VA, uh, which means it's capable uh, of 320 watts continuous and 400 watts peak. Um, doesn't sound much different from you know a normal 650 VA UPS but there is a major difference um, here's the I guess what would be a normal size battery for a 650 VA UPS this is probably um, I believe this is a 9 amp hour battery I don't know if a 650 has an 8 amp hour or a 9 amp hour but pretty much similar to this one um, pretty much the UPS would be around that size and would be able to run your computer at only half load for 15 minutes. This 650 VA UPS has a 40 amp hour. Yes, I said 40 from 9 to 40 amp hour uh, deep cycle battery. It actually has 220 amp hour uh, deep cycle AGM batteries wired in parallel to give you that extra capacity. So it's a pretty powerful device. You can see the box is, it can extend backup office time by eight hours. Of course, that's gonna be with your laptop and a couple of lights. Um, actual users have seen nine hours out of this thing with just a laptop. Now with your desktop, it should give you anywhere from one to about three hours max. And I'll go ahead and test that with my quad core and let you guys know, but just getting through the unboxing. Which is going to be kind of hard because you can see it's quite a large box. Um, it's almost as high as my 22 inch monitor back there and a lot wider. And 40 pounds by the way. It's 36 point something pounds. I'll just say it's 40 because it feels every bit of 40 pounds. So, oh, one thing is if you're watching this on Techno Buffalo on my blog, uh, you know this is the UPS I was talking about. The uh, best UPS for the money because there's no other UPS that can compare to this thing as far as the runtime goes. Uh, that's one thing that's different about this. This is actually a UPS that's made to run for a longer time versus have a um, higher VA rating. So most UPSs 15-20 minutes are you know the maximum run times of them even if you get a really expensive uh, 2000 VA model. I know the APC Smart UPSs have only about a 15 20 minute runtime, and those cost four to five hundred dollars. Um, this costs right around, I guess, an average of 250 to 350. Right now, it's running about 350 dollars since they have a short supply. But I got a pretty good deal. My power, uh, power pack solar actually went bad on me. Uh, something happened with the inverter, I had to send it back. And they gave me a choice between this and a couple other power packs. And since this had the largest battery, the longest runtime, I decided to get this since this is four times stronger than the power pack solar. You know, in order to get the capacity of this thing, I would have to keep charging the power pack solar in the sun for four weeks. So just went with the larger capacity. I may have to set the camera down because this thing is kind of hard to get out. It's 40 pounds, it's going to crush the bag. So. Let me set that down, and I'll show you guys our thing. Whoa. It's extremely heavy. Box aside. Okay, and here we have the uh, Xantrex X Power Power Pack Solar. Ah, uh, sorry, Power Source 400 UPS and power supply. So it's an LCD UPS with a really long extended runtime. Pretty heavy, like I said, 36 pounds. Got it nice and wrapped up here. It looks like I have to recharge it. Do an initial recharge and it says recharge the unit at least once every three months. Here you see the LCD screen. I'm going to try to power it on, see if it has any power. Okay. Looks like it doesn't have any charge in it, so I'm going to charge it up. But it uh, has five outlets, one up here, and then four more in the back. 
It also has a little LED that comes on, which I'm going to show you, which is pretty neat. When the power goes out, lights up. Pretty bright. It's a blue LED. So it has a built-in flashlight into the UPS. It is also fan cool. That's one reason it can run so long, and that also helps with the huge batteries and everything. Uh, it's got a shiny uh, silver or gray plastic exterior. And like I said, this thing is heavy. I'm not even going to show you all the dimensions of it. It looks like it's got a six-foot cord, so pretty long. Um, check back later for the review. You know, that'll probably be in the next couple of days or within a week. Uh, I may get some run times in for you guys. But for those of you who watch me on Techno Buffalo, I finally got it. You know, this was my first post on that blog was about this UPS and... Uh, before it was pretty cheap. I could have got it for 150 bucks, but waited too long. It ran out. Price went up to 300. Uh, so I opted for the Power Pack Solar. That went bad on me, so got this now. So an emergency backup power device that is quite useful. So thanks for watching. See you guys later. Peace.